Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to take an overview about login, user, role, and principle. So let's talk about quickly uh, what is login. Uh, I will be talking about conceptual uh, definition of these uh, terms uh, rather than word-to-word uh, -word definition. So login, whenever we wanted to uh, have any user connect to SQL Server, we create login in SQL Server. Name suggests that it will let you let the user log into the SQL Server. So there are a couple ways that you can create login in SQL Server. One is uh, SQL Server authentication, and other is Windows authentication. We'll get into that later. But uh, uh, real quick, it is a way to get into your SQL Server. So uh, anybody who wanted to connect to SQL Server needs to have a login with one exception, however. Uh, in SQL Server 2012 and SQL Server 2014, there is a concept called contained database. If there is a contained database, you don't have to have a SQL Server login to connect to that particular database. And we will get into the detail of contained database, how to create contained database and con uh, contained database users. And I'll show you in a demo uh, that how to do that. Uh, next, when we uh, uh, see a term user, basically for in uh, SQL ser Server world and in DBA world, when we uh, talk about user, we're talking about database user. We're talking about a person who is trying to get into database. When you create a login, that does not mean that you can look at the data inside the databases of SQL Server. Uh, you have to have a user in that particular database in order to look at the data in that database. So database really, uh, user really goes to the database. Next is role. Role has two scopes. One is server level scope and other is uh, a database level scope. What role basically is that when we talk about server level scope, we put together um, a bunch of uh, logins and assign uh, those login to do a particular function in a server in a SQL server. So in, in previous versions in way previous versions of SQL server it used to be called groups but the new fancy name is role. So when we talk about the SQL server level that means that we're putting together uh, uh, different uh, logins and um, assigning uh, different logins to do different duties and we can uh, define that particular role that you're going to do this you're going to create the database you're going to delete the database you can do such and such and we put that we create that sql server role and put all the users that we wanted to give those permission to in that particular role and next thing is the database uh, a role the same thing is same concept for the database that you create a database role um, and uh, you put uh, all the database users in a group and assign them a particular function in the database such as you can do uh, you can access uh, uh, these many objects you can uh, do uh, certain things on a particular table uh, this role can do uh, such and such so that is a database scope role and what is principle when we to, uh, principle has a, a wider range basically when we talk about server we're talking about uh, login user and roles they're all principle as far as a uh, uh, server goes when we're talking about database we go into the database we're talking about all the entities in the database become principal all the users in the database becomes principal so principle have a much wider um, scope as far as a uh, server and uh, the database goes. We'll be uh, going through how to create login, user, role, all that. I just wanted to uh, quickly mention basically what is the concept behind login, user, role, principle because you will be hearing a lot about uh, creating login, creating a user, assigning permissions to user, assigning permission to role, and adding the principle, removing the principle. So I, I thought that I should go ahead and clear some of the concepts about login, user, role, and principle. And I hope this uh, a little quick overview of login, user, role, and principle in terms of SQL Server and in terms of SQL Server databases help.